Oh, good evening, Johnny. Hello. How are you? Fine, teacher. Yeah. Great. Today is Wednesday, October 20th. See how it goes today. So what did you do today? Only war. You just worked? How was work? Yeah. Um, boring. <laughs> boring the work. Your work is boring? Something. A little bit. I had to check, had to check in some his some costs. Costs, how you say? Spence. Cost costs expenses. You have to cut your cost. expenses or what? Both costs and expenses. I had to check in the documentation. Mm, okay. Yeah. So boring checking all that. <laughs> do you like what you do? Um, yeah, I like it, but. Uh, Sometimes the bore boring. Sometimes you get bored. Yeah. Okay. Just waiting for yeah. the others. Teacher, what, what, what? Uh, teacher. Why is your uh, yeah, favorite club and sport? My favorite club in sports, they used to be the Chicago Bulls. They used to Chicago. be. Uh -huh. in, in, in soccer match? In soccer, um, I will say Barcelona. Um, Barcelona. Yeah. Now they win. Two, three, four, five, five, six. Yeah. Barcelona, what about you? Um, Barcelona. You go with Barcelona too. Okay. Even without Messi? Yeah. Uh, yeah, without Messi. Okay. But the, I like yeah, the, the Barcelona when was uh, Ronaldinho, Xavi, Iniesta, not only Messi because. Not only Messi. No, not only Messi. In the platform, we had to finish all the exercises. All the exercises, yes. Um, 
We're about to start. Okay, so how many are we? We are 11. Oh my God, where are the others? Today is Wednesday. What's going on? Was there traffic? Was there a lot of traffic? Hey, Doc, how are you? Good evening, Ada. How are you tonight? Hello, teacher. Good evening. I, I, my day is uh, more or less. I am uh, um, at uh, my day is a lot um, work on desk. I, I don't like. I bored. <laughs> you get not, you get bored, really? Yes, I know. I know. I like. <laughs> Me gusta más movimiento de trabajo. Okay. Yeah, it's true. Sometimes you get bored of uh, yes. desk job, you know, office job is sometimes boring. It's important for me. <laughs> um, these are uh, last two weeks of the October on Saturday with the school work and the exams, final <laughs> the final exams for the kids is true. Yes, I am a lot of work and repasar. Review? Yeah, review the, the, the class for the exam finals. The final it's exams, a, yes. Yes, it's a, it's a, a lot of complicated uh, for terminar. For, about to finish, okay. Yes. Eh, estuve tratando de revisar el video, pero como que está algo trabado el de ayer, ¿verdad? Mm. Lo vi así como algo... O, o, o no sé si será el, el, el internet que quise, pero no pude verlo así por completo la, la, en la clase. No sé si tenía problemas ahí. De, mi, mi internet o esa... El, El video mal grabado, Picha. Mm, no, si lo revisé, está bien. Okay. Pero no lo mandó anoche. Tuve que entrar a la plataforma a buscarlo, ¿eh? Mm, ¿Cómo no? Sí, sí lo envié. Ah, no, no lo envié al chat. No, ya no los están enviando al chat, sino que en la plataforma los están subiendo. Mm. Okay, let's start doing the attendance. Oh my God, we are 12. Where are the others? I'm really concerned now. Teacher, mm -hmm. my song uh, uh, with you. Only say good, e good evening, teacher, my song. The good morning, teacher. Good evening. Good evening. <laughs> hey, how are you, Carlitos? Y Sebastián. Oh, Sebastián, ok. <laughs> Está bien. <laughs> Hi, Sebas, how are you? Fine. Fine. <laughs> ok. How old are you? ¿Cuántos años? Uh -huh. Fine. You're five. Oh my God, he's five years old. He's, he's speaking English. Very good. <laughs> nice to meet you, Sebas. Nice to meet you too. Nice to meet you too. You see, it's that easy. <laughs> Very good. Okay, guys, let me do the attendance um, because it's already 8, 10 p.m. Tonight we have a huge review of these two units that we have covered so far. We're gonna check everything. It's gonna be fun, it's gonna be easy, okay? Don't worry. So, let's see, Ada Susana Cáceres Mendoza. Present, teacher. 
Thank you, Alexander de Jesus Sanchez Soto. Present. Andres Giovanni Valdivieso Portillo. Present. Awesome. Elvin Arcides Eguizabal Martinez. Present. Irwin Lagos Andrade. Present teacher. Good. Fernando Ernesto Cosme Morales. Present. Thank you. Heidi Eugenia Salguero de Rivas. Here yet. Johnny Vladimir Portillo Chávez. Present teacher. Thank you. Jose, Jose Antonio Cubías Hernández. Josué Alberto Salas Benítez. Juan Francisco Enríquez González. Yuri Vladimir Cruz Ventura. Luis Ernesto Romero Argueta. Miguel Ángel Paz Landa Verde. It's reported on the chat. Roberto Luis Umaño Orellana. Sandra Elizabeth Osorto Romero. Present. Thank you. Werner Mauricio Reyes Ángel. Here yet. William Alexander Ramírez Flores. Present. Thank you. Jocelyn Imelda Rivas Abarca. Present teacher. Thank you. Suleima Ivonne Moreno de Hernández. Alan Christopher Abrego Brizuela. Carolina Ivette Romero Avelino. Irene Azucena Cuellar Albanés. Thank you. Isela Liliana Miranda Espinosa, Iván Manuel Jerez Pérez. Not here yet. René Alfonso Madrid Escalante. Present teacher. Good. Wendy Patricia Molina Duarte. Present teacher. Thank you. Alan is here already, Alexander too. Okay, let's do this. We are 16 already. So, stage. Hey, what's here. Juan Francisco, yes. Thank you. Got you. I got you. Okay, guys. So, today we're supposed to review all of your topics on units one and two. So, we're just going to go one by one easily. I will just give you a um, a scenario, a scenario for you to have a conversation, okay? So the first part of unit one was the product life cycle. So let's recall, let's remember in groups what you remember about the product life cycle. What was each definition? This starts on page nine. Have you ever part? One minute, please. Sorry. I feel I'm gelling and I'm not supposed to do that. So, okay, so we're good now. I just mute you. Okay, so first part, have you ever participated in the development of a new product? Okay, have you ever participated on the development of a new product? Remember that question? It was the first question of this module. You said, yes, I have, no, I have never tried a new product, you know, or developed a new product. Now let's talk about your ideas to develop a new product. What do you think it has to look like? I mean, what's the first thing you have to do to develop a new product? It doesn't exist, it's a whole new line on your company. So how do you develop the product? This is the four P's. Who can tell me what are the four? I'm sorry, <laughs> what? Is the product life cycle? What was the first stage of the product life cycle? Market, intro market introduction. Okay. That is the first. Second. Second. Uh, growth. Growth. Very growth. good. Third. Uh, maturity. Maturity and decline. decline decline stage. Very good. You only have 10 minutes to talk about these four stages of the product life cycle with your classmates. And this class is going to be uh, like that. You know, we're going to recall the information. And at the end, I will conduct a survey to all of you. 
Okay, we're going to do a dynamic for you to speak and keep moving forward with these topics, okay? So this starts on page nine, it covers page 10 too. Let's get together. There's 17. We're gonna be small groups. We're 18 now, okay. Okay, let's go. Hello, everyone. Hello, how are you? Oh, very, uh, very, very uh, my, tired. Yeah, tired. My, my, my day very busy because I uh, now because now I receive a new employee to start their training after the indication that they were given uh, we were assign assigned assigned a sewing operation of uh, 36 employees today so complicated uh, for that my day was very brief <laughs> yeah i'm sorry for you you need, uh, um, you, I, I, sorry, teacher, I don't pay attention when you give the uh, indication what, uh, what I do or where, what, uh, what, do we do? We, what do we do? What do we do? Yeah. We're covering the four stages of the product life cycle. Okay. Market introduction. We're talking growth, about the, and decline. the product life cycle, right? Yes, this is today is a review of the first two units. We have to do yeah. a review of everything. Just discuss. Just, just discuss what do you remember about market introduction, the growth um, stage, maturity, and the decline stage. What happens on each stage? Okay. 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 Um, we have to start in the page nine. Uh, everyone have your book? Nah, okay, let me check. Uh, Francisco, what, what do you remember about the market introduction? Uh, I, don't, I don't know, I don't remember. <laughs> I don't remember, <laughs> sorry. I, I check. I check. I I I I think uh, uh, the growth decline uh, market introduction. That's true. Mm -hmm. yeah. yeah. Okay. Uh, I remember growth. Uh, when you uh, uh speak uh, uh some product uh, or company uh. When you, uh, when you can see uh, the demand of the product, the, uh, the, the company, uh, the customer uh, pay, uh, some, some work is attractive for the customer. Uh, the company there are uh, demand and grow the, in, the, in the market. Is the teacher we gonna yeah. ask ask it ask him tonight the night <laughs> uh, just uh, teacher uh, the do is um, talking about the the product's life or we have to choose any product and. Just recall the information. Remember, product life cycle. Okay.
But I remember, I remember that in that class I was fell asleep. <laughs> And come on. It's difficult. Oh, why is difficult? Come on, go to your book. Page yeah, one, I right? found it. That's page. Found... Yeah. Nine. No. Ten. Page nine and ten. Hmm. Hmm. Born, grow, get a job, and die. Market introduction, <laughs> growth. Uh huh. Marry, get a job, decline in maturity. Yeah. It's better to talk with. About your goals. What goals? Your goals. <laughs> <laughs> My goal is to start doing overtime at work and gather enough money to rebuild my car this Christmas. Money is not enough. In life? Yeah, not in life, but when sometimes you got a specific goals and you need to do specific things to achieve these goals. And that's what I need to do right now. I need to work like crazy. I cannot use the right phrase right now. Uh, you, you consider that you are a, work, a workaholic? Not right now. I'm having too much time off. I'm off from 12.30 until 8. 12.30? <laughs> that's, yeah, You're 12. 12 30 p.m. to 8. I'm off. I'm doing nothing, just playing with the kids, doing some last homeworks, exams, you know. And that's not you okay. You are in the maturity level. Or... <laughs> yeah. Yeah. Information about this concept co branding. <laughs> What's up, teacher? Okay. Come on. <laughs> hey, there's a lot, there's a lot to talk about in each stage of the product life cycle. I mean the market introduction. What do you remember? What did we talk about on the market introduction? What what does that consist of? Okay, what Trying is to, what is the growth to, uh, stage? In the market introduction, I'm trying to get attention of the people and trying to, you are completely uh, done with the product. You are testing the, the product and you have tested the product and it's already to sell and you have to get a, a market strategy to introduce into the market, right? That's right. Okay, you see, you know, you know. <laughs> Hey, come on! I, I'm I'm going to be I'm going to be honest. Market is boring for me. I'm a shopaholic. I'm the it's the contrast. I don't sell. I buy. Yeah, everybody is a consumer in the end, right? Shopaholic, mm, but shopaholic. Yes. Even if you don't have the money. That's the point. Right. The reason why. Okay, so market introduction growth. When does your product grow? After you launch it, what happens? Hmm. If you're lucky enough. Just if you are lucky enough, your product is start working and sell it. <clears throat> so the demand increases mm, yes possible if you are lucky enough if you're lucky enough and your offer will increase as well okay what happens next 
maturity, maturity and then decline. Talk about it. I'll make you questions after this. <laughs> the homes are using for for the product life cycle. I think. Okay, what do you think, Fernando? <clears throat> did, did you remember how how much that that, that activity? Uh, there there is the concepts. When well, there are the concepts about each of uh, of the stages. For example, mm -hmm. I I have uh, maturity is uh, the product. The product is no longer attractive for many customers. Sales stop, and the procedures start making decisions about discontinuing the product. Bringing now competitors or selling or selling it to another produce that is maturity. Mm -hmm. uh, marketing introduction. At this stage, a new product is brought in, into the market. The demand of the product may be low and marketing efforts try right to develop branding, quality and awareness of the new product to innovators. That is marketing introduction. And decline, the growth in sales decreases because there are many competitors. Market saturation of course. The marketing effort work to dif dif differentiate, differentiate, differentiate. The product and prices might be lower than in the previous stages. And the stage of ground is the new product register and increase in demand because more customers accept, accept it. The sales start to, to grow and there is little competition. That is the concept. But uh, when when I was talking about in the in the uh, in the unit one, <clears throat> we we did examples about that when when uh when, in, in the activities I, I remember more or less. Uh, I was talking about what product was talking about. about. Mm. Uh, some, exam some examples about this concept, for example, we talking about growth. Uh, I remember we, we did uh, an activity about uh, we, we, we had to, show, to choose a product and we have to research about that. Uh, I, in my group, we we researched about uh, uh, BlackBerry. I, I remember BlackBerry, uh, Nokia, and about batteria Fayovac. For example, nowadays some some features in electrodomestic and another kind of things are are electronicals and and. And the batteries, batteries for your back. Nowadays, I think any person are looking for that. Maybe this is an example for growth because the demand about this product maybe is low right now. Yes. Uh... Hmm. Let me see. Another. Ah, I, me I remember that. I remember too. Uh, we 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 uh, talked about uh, the the yeah. strategies to 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 avoid the the, the decline of the of the product. I think. It's the strategies to, to, to abide the decline. Um. What kind of example you can give me about the letter eight? 
letter A. The pros longer attractive for the customer. Mm. What do you mean in a, in a page of a, a book or or the, or where? Erwin, I'm sorry, I didn't notice you were alone. I think that I must be with, with, with three guys. <laughs> yes, I see. But after that, I don't know what happened. And I got disconnected. Oh, okay, no problem. It's okay. And it's okay, no problem. Okay. Teacher, are you car? How would you cut? I was telling Alan that I'm going to work overtime to gather some money and um, repair it, you know, like rebuild, rebuild the whole thing, hopefully soon. So Christmas, I'm going to be working my, I'm going to be working a lot. Please, uh, remember, for to be happy, for to be happy, all person we have to work so hard. Yeah, that's the only that's, thing. You have to, that's the only that's, thing. That's what it takes. Correct. Okay. So. I think we're ready. Did you check the product life cycle? Do you have any questions? Are we clear? Uh, yes, teacher, we check the concept. Okay. Okay, let's keep going then. Okay, let's see. How many are we? Everybody's back. It means that we are 16 in the class. Okay, give me just a minute. 16. Okay. So here we go. So look at your WhatsApp. I want you to go to your, your, your WhatsApp and look at this. I just sent you an image and those are your groups right now. Just locate your name, locate your name Okay, good, I think we're ready. So, Alan, give me a number between one and 27. One and 27. Any number. Uh, uh, 11. 11, Juan Francisco Enriquez Gonzalez. Okay, Juan Francisco is in which group? Mm, number four. Number four. Okay. okay, so group number four, it's gonna start this dynamic, this activity. Okay, so we're gonna start with Juan Francisco. Give me a minute. It's going to show two screens. Okay, you can see both of my screens, right? You can see the full screen, right? Yeah. Yes. Okay, yes, bien, estas son, las, estas son las instrucciones, señores. Tienen un minuto para contestar cada pregunta como equipo, quien sea del equipo. En este caso vamos con el grupo 4, tiene 
un minuto para contestar la pregunta que le toque, ¿ok? Ok, teacher. Uh oh, okay. <laughs> oh, you know what? I'm making a little mistake here. Not yet. No, that was easier, teacher. <laughs> yeah, but not yet. Because we still have to go through the next topics. We haven't. So we just reviewed the product life cycle, the four stages. Really quick, Jocelyn, what are the four stages? And it's product, place, price, and promotion. Oh, no. No, what are the four stages of the product life cycle? Uh, okay. It's marketing introduction. Oh, wait. It's marketing market introduction. Introduction. Growth. Growth. Maturity and decline. Good, and decline. decline stage. Okay, very good. What is the maturity stage about? What is the maturity stage about? It's when then the product is recognized by the customer. When the product is recognized by the customers, what happened then in the maturity yeah. stage? There's something very important in the maturity stage of a product. What happens with the product on the maturity stage? Oh, 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 oh. It sells. It sells, the but... Sales, the sales grow and... Sales grow. The marketing now know the product. Okay. Can sales increase? Very, very high, the demand. The demand is high on the maturity stage. Uh, mm. So not when the market is sat saturated, the product. You have saturated the product in the market, yes. So your price cannot go any higher. The top. That's the top the price. Top. You reach the, the top, top price. Market. So what's the okay. next stage? Decline. Decline. decline stage very good okay let's do this together then what can you do on the decline stage to avoid going on bankruptcy or having to remove the product from the market what are the options that you have the alternatives to avoid the decline stage jump from the boat <laughs> No, you don't want to jump from innovation. The innovation. Innovation. Okay. Define innovation. define Product. innovation, Johnny. Yeah. Define innovation, innovation is change change characteristic. Change of the, the characteristics of the product. Okay. Yeah. Good. Like yeah. A relaunch. A relaunch. Okay, you can do a relaunch of the product. Why not? What else? What else? But why does the company decide to discount in the it's product continue, or discontinue discontinue on the product or maybe selling it to another producer? Selling your or, line. Do you really want to sell your line of product? It was difficult. It took you months to create the product. And it's good and you believe in your product. What else can you do? Repackaging. Co Repackaging, co-branding. Repackaging, co-branding. Can you define... By the, um, the competitors. Competitor. Competitors. 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 Acordate del stress. Competitors. Mm -hmm. My tongue is like a little bit... Uh, don't try to cooperate with me. <laughs> no, it's try to buy the competitors. <laughs> Uh -huh. Instead of sell your product, is done. in that way you can reduce the uh, yeah the loss, but it must is the saturation that is the thing that is, uh, yeah. affect your product. Isn't that dangerous? If you desaturate the market in that way, you know. 
That's risky. It's That's there is, risky. There, there is a, 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 um, a specific word that I don't remember. How can you say it? Co-branding? Mm. No, it's more aggressive word. I don't remember. How can you say it? I'm, 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 I'm going to find it out. Fears? Competitiveness? No, when you is uh, in Spanish is como uh, acaparar. Oh, saturate. No, because it's saturate is the different company, right? It's not the 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 only one. But when you are the owner of that product in all the companies, is you can manage the price as you want. You be, it becomes a monopoly. Yeah, something like that. Uh, what's the word that you used? I'm sorry, regarding the price. Manage or can manipulate the price as you want. And we talked about that last mm -hmm. month, last, last week. Uh, we talked about doing dumping remember that that was different okay yeah i can remember okay Pr uh, yes price dumping you could do that i think there's where alan wants to get when you do when you cheat on the price, right? I got you, I got your idea. Okay. Okay, so those are the stages of the product life cycle. Next, let's play a game. Okay, so remember, will you prefer or would you rather? If you remember, how do you, uh, how do you use that grammar? That was simple, but at the same time you had some trouble um let me just reinforce that really quick so when you use would prefer how do you do it mm -hmm. no 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 it's two separate right. things you had will rather and you had will prefer veins mm -hmm. for of the bird uh-huh. Can you give an example with will preferred? Mm. Uh-huh. Exactly. I would. I go. I will rather. Uh -uh. I will prefer. Mm -hmm. mm. I will prefer. I will prefer. I will prefer. Um, eat pizza. Eat. Two. Eat. Eat. eat pizza. Pizza. Okay, Johnny. To eat pizza, then <laughs> bean. <laughs> huh? Come on, guys, everybody, give me an example. I would prefer to drink coca. Okay, to drink coke. Coke. Okay, one more. I would prefer work, working from, from home. I will prefer working or to work from home. Good, now let's go with would rather. Okay. Wait, how do you make a question with will prefer? Would you prefer dry in the morning? Uh -huh. Be careful. Would you prefer to drive 
In the morning. Would you prefer to buy a new GTI than repair the new car? <laughs> then repairing your car. No, I will prefer to repair my car. Okay. Would you prefer to buy? Uh huh. Exactly. That's the way you make a question with "Will you prefer?" Let's go with "Will rather." Give me examples, positive, and then we do some questions. Come on, come on. Let's do it. Everybody was thinking twice on the exam in this um, context, in, the, in this grammar. You were having problems with will rather. Come on. You need a subject, then will rather, and then the verb. I can try it out. Uh, students will rather. Uh, I will rather be in the beach. Okay, I'll rather be in the, at the beach. I would rather be in the beach. I would rather be at the beach. Good. A question. Would you rather... Um, I don't know if be at the beach or to be at the beach. Change it, the verb. It proposes instead fixo. Wait, the queso? Uh, yeah. Poopas. <laughs> yeah, she's poopas. She's poopas, okay. You ready to buy online? Okay, uh huh. Johnny, would you rather? To buy buy online. online. Oh, that's the point. You don't use the preposition before the verb here. You just need the verb base, the, the base verb. Would you rather buy what? Online? Online. Or? Or in the market. That's just saying person. So that's the way you do a... Uh, a question or positive sentences with will rather. Remember, I will prefer the infinitive. I will prefer to eat. I will prefer to drink. I will prefer working or to work. I will prefer driving in the morning or the evening. Um, would you prefer driving in the morning or the evening? Would you prefer to drive in the morning or in the evening? Whichever you prefer. But always you need the preposition before the verb or an ing form of the verb. Are we clear on that? Mm -hmm. You sure? Yes. Okay. Can you repeat that again, please? Yes, of course. Okay. Um, That's the whole point. You need the infinitive or the gerund of the verb after prefer to, okay? To drive or driving, to work or working, to drink or drinking, eat, to eat or eating, but always to. After will prefer, you need these forms of the verbs. The base for. Sí, o ocupas la forma base del verbo o ocupas el gerundio con ing. Oh, Would you prefer buying online or in person? Teacher uh, is correct. Say we prefer buy only that. It's correct. No. No. It's used to buy. Yeah. Would okay. you prefer to buy? Would you prefer buying? E um see, 
se pregunta, is it correct to say? Is it correct to say? Todos comen, a mí me pasa a veces también por hacer la pregunta, ¿es correcto? Digo, it is correct to say, porque es bien fácil equivocarse en esa parte. It is correct. No. Is it correct? Is it correct to say? Good. Ok. Acuérdense, el auxiliar va primero siempre en todo tiempo gramatical. En las preguntas cerradas, el auxiliar va primero para hacer una pregunta cerrada. Ok. Don't forget that. Number two. So, with would rather, what do you need? You need a bear base. Un verbo chulón. Don't forget that. Yeah. Eso quiere decir bear. Bear también. Desnudo. Ok. Rather be. Rather eat. No necesitas la preposición. Just the base verb. The bear verb. The bear verb. Así, dicen los Así dicen los británicos. The bear verb. Ok. You see? Rather stay. Rather be. Rather eat. Rather buy. But only the base form of the verb. Uh, for mm -hmm. example, I can use uh, the gerund with the no. rather. Try it. Try to do it. Give me an example. Mm. I would rather eating cheese. Uh. <laughs> no. I would rather I would rather be eating cheese. <laughs> ¿Qué estoy diciendo ahí? Preferiría. En ambos ejemplos estoy diciendo preferiría. En ambos ejemplos estoy diciendo preferiría o preferiría. Se me pregunta. Um, mm -hmm. La diferencia está en la gramática en estos, eh, en estos tiempos, en este ejemplo de gramática. Okay. That's the point. Okay. Just be careful. Come on. Are we clear? Yes, yeah. In this case, yes, rarer is not considered like a bear. Or what is uh, the rule about it? Yes, you got it. ¿Qué está diciendo? Preferiría quedarme. Okay. Los estudiantes prefieren o preferirían quedarse callados que en lugar de okay, hablar en inglés. Preferiría estar en la playa. I would rather be at the beach. Would you rather eat cheese pupusas or pork pupusas? ¿Preferirías comer pupusas de queso o de chicharrón? Cerdo. Hey. I know, but... What's the grammar rule? Yeah. Yes, by itself, will rather or will prefer means preferirías. O preferi, pre, prefieren, preferirían. Right. It's something set up. It's a set up. It's a set of words. You got it. Okay. Uh-huh. Um, come again. Erwin. Will he rather buy or buy? Oh, third person? Third person. Yeah, yeah. Don't worry. Third Don't worry about that. No, no, no. It's okay. She she will rather buy. She will rather stay with me. She will rather marry. She will rather marry uh, Mr. Bean than me. She will rather marry Mr. Bean than me. For example. So, let's play a game, shall we? Let's play a game. I'm going to split the class again. You have 10 minutes to make as many questions as possible to your classmates in your group. Make as many questions as possible. Um, Ada, would you rather study law than medicine? Would you rather study law than medicine? Sure. William, would you rather drink a pet uh, Pilsner or a Corona? Nothing. Corona. <laughs> a Corona, right? I got it. I got it. Yes, you had a question, William. What's up? Um, duda. Este, mm -hmm. por, eh, quiero ver um, cuál es la diferencia. Por ejemplo, estaba leyendo que el cuando usar el Dan. In English, ejemplo, come cuando, on. Cuando hay elecciones, no lo puedo decir. <laughs> Comparativo. En este caso, tener dos opciones, so te recomiendo usar or. One or the other. Sí, pero es que, vaya, yo estaba viendo ese por uh, 
decía el tú, o sea, cuando tiene dos opciones, eh, no usar el dan, sino el tú. Tú. No sé si sabe ahí. Claro que sí, se puede también. Y mi recomendación de siempre es, escúchate, que suena mejor. Siempre que estés uh, hablando de esa manera. Uh, it's like, would you rather eat, would you rather have beans to tomatoes? I don't know, mm -hmm. would you rather have beans to tomatoes? It sounds weird. Would you rather have beans or tomatoes? No, oh, okay. Suena mejor, ¿verdad? Or tomatoes. Una o la otra. It's always two options. Good question. Okay. Would you rather buy a coat for winter or a short? I don't know. Any question. Try to make sense. Try to make sense using these questions. So, es un reto. Necesito que de verdad retes a tu compañero haciéndole cuantas preguntas puedas ahorita usando would rather. Ok. Or will prefer. Cualquiera de las dos. Solo enfócate en que si usas will prefer to. Verb. Will rather. Verb. Good. And give your answer. No, man. Be, be, be natural. No, man, I would rather, of course not. I would prefer to, see, let's do it. Okay, let's go, let's go. Just 10 minutes and we come back. Alan, would you prefer to buy uh, buy a Mexican food or pupusas? Oh, come on. I, I, would, rather eat, I would rather eat pupusas instead of Mexican food, of course. Obviously. <laughs> hey. That's the the point. This uh, national food, you know, the the who's in the heaven wants to eat Corona instead of Pilsen? No, that's not the point. We are out of <laughs> eat or drink. <laughs> it, it, it's an example. Oh, it's an example. Okay, well, if you eat yeah. a Corona, yeah, I prefer. <laughs> I prefer eat pupusas instead of Mexican food. That sounds weird. I prefer eat pupusas. Correct yourself. I would, I, I would prefer eat, to eat pupusas instead of Mexican food. And there is where you right? go. Like, mm, it sounds better if I say I prefer eating pupusas then. Yeah. I would rather... Eating pupusas. Uh -uh. That's something no. you cannot do. I would rather eat pupusas. Ah, okay. And yes, if you are asked with preferred to, yes, you can answer with rather. Mm, okay. That, I, I'm, and that's the point I want to, to emphasize. To get, yeah. Good. It's do not, it. Okay. I'm going to choose uh, Ivan. Uh, would you prefer to sleep in from eight to six a.m. or be in class from eight to ten? I would rather sleep all night long and and the day after. <laughs> Sorry, <I> teacher, <laughs> you break your heart. It's okay, yeah. it's okay. But you said from eight to six a.m. and like what? 6 to 8 p.m. maybe or 6 to 8 a.m. 
p.m. 8 p.m. to 6 a.m. Only. Oh, well, yeah, right. Okay, I'm sorry. Yeah, that makes more sense. Okay. Okay, keep going, keep going. Is you um, drive? <laughs> I prefer to drive an automatic car because it's more easily. <gasps> but, uh, it's, it's it's easier. It's easier. <laughs> thank you. Thank you. <laughs> but uh, nowadays, I'm I drive a standard car. Oh my god! Okay. Um. William. Um. Would you rather? Uh, Drink coffee or Coke? Uh, I would rather drink coffee the whole time. Yeah, I agree with you. <laughs> because I like coffee. <laughs> okay, Suleyma. So uh... What would you, would you like to be? Um, a lion or an elephant? Um, I prefer uh, to, uh, I prefer, <laughs> I don't know. In the neck. <laughs> <laughs> I don't like uh, an elephant. And lion too, uh, but if you say you select, uh, I prefer a lion. <laughs> okay. But uh, would you like rather have a dog or a cat? Well, I rather have cats because cat. I like to spend time with cats. Cats are, okay. they're not need more um, things because the cats, they are, they are independent. Yeah, right. but, the, but the cat yeah. is noisy <laughs> in, the, in the night. <laughs> yeah. yeah, at night. At night, sorry. <laughs> It's very noisy. It's very noisy. You you don't you don't sleep because wow, wow, all the night. But <laughs> you know what? Uh, I figure out that some cat or cats in general have the ability yeah. to go out or get out the stress. Yeah. Yeah. When you uh because they are uh fuzzy, loose. Yeah. Yeah. Okay. If you. Um, I think. Maybe. Uh... Mama, baby, baby. Do, would you prefer to drive, drive, ride, to ride a bicycle or run? Run. I prefer run. <laughs> yes, I, I drive would prefer run <laughs> because I can drive the, the bicycle. <laughs> oh, really? <laughs> yes. <laughs> I would prefer. Maybe wrong, not much, but maybe uh, I don't like wrong too. <laughs> so you prefer run? Yes. In my case, maybe walk. I prefer wrong. <laughs> I prefer walk. <laughs> I would. I will, I would prefer to rest. <laughs> <laughs> no option, Juan Francisco. Uh, <laughs> oh, um, bicycle, maybe. 
I don't know what you say. Ninguna de las anteriores. I don't know. Any, any option. Sleep. Hey, you think that San Francisco? Can you college? Sorry, no, I, I don't. Usted es maestro, ahí dice Ah, no, it's a, uh, uh, today my daughter uh, oh. has an was, activity. We had a exposition about the <laughs> children day. Creí que era un comercial ese. No. I thought you, you are a <laughs> What's going on? Are you stressed tonight? Uh -huh. Are you stressed tonight? Oh no, I was telling telling something to my sister. Okay. <laughs> it looked like oh no, again this guy. <laughs> Tragedy. That that's my daughter. Something like that. That's my <laughs> daughter. <laughs> She, that's my daughter. She she's um, a drama queen. My daughter is a drama queen. My friends call me call me that drama, <laughs> drama queen. queen. <laughs> really, Alan? Is she a drama queen? No, absolutely not. She's a seriously person. A serious person? Nah. Really? Yes, like, of course. Believe uh, me. Let, let me give you an example. <laughs> my daughter. I sent my daughter to to take a shower today and she's a little bit sick right with and I warmed some water for her to take a shower and she was like can I play with my toys for a minute I was like mm, yeah sure and then she started crying it's just that you removed the bathtub Quitaste la bañera, me dijo Latina. You removed the bathtub. Now I cannot play with my toys. Uh, and she spent 10 minutes crying. I'm like, what? Why? Come on. What do we do, right? Why are you like that, women? You're always like that. Ever since you're a little, little girls, you know, you're so drama. I mean, oh my God. No only women. No only women. No only women. I know. What happened, teacher? Oh, <laughs> yeah, some some guys as well, right? Man. Okay. So next topic. Great, great job talking about. Would you rather or would you prefer? Keep that in mind at all times. Um, next thing I want to. Oh well, hold on. Let's do the attendance really quick and we move on. Um, hmm. Ada Susana Cáceres Mendoza. Present teacher. Alexander de Jesús Sánchez Soto. Present. Andrés Giovanni Valdivieso Portillo. Present teacher. Elvin Arcide Seguizabal Martínez. Present. Irwin Lagos Andrade. Present Fern teacher. Present. Present. Fernando Ernesto Cosme Morales. Thank you. It's okay. Thank you. Heidi Eugenia Salguero de Rivas. I thought I saw Heidi somewhere. No, right? Okay. Johnny Vladimir Portillo Chavez. Present teacher. Thank you. Jose Antonio Cubillas Hernandez. He's having problems with the internet, I think. Still. Okay. Josue Alberto Salas Benitez. Juan Francisco Enriquez Gonzalez. Good. 
Yuri Vladimir Cruz Ventura, Luis Ernesto Romero Argueta. Present teacher. There you are, thank you. Miguel Ángel Paz Landa Verde. Miguel Ángel Paz Landa Verde. Oh, he, he said he was not coming here. Okay, Roberto Luis Umaño Arellana. Not today, okay. Sandra Elizabeth Osorto Romero. Present. Thank you. Werner Mauricio Reyes Ángel. William Alexander Ramírez Flores. Present. Jocelyn Imelda Rivas Abarca. Thank you. Just Suleima Yvonne Moreno de Hernández. Present. Thank you. Alan Christopher Abrego Brizuela. Present. Thank you. Carolina Ivette Romero Avelino. I'm here. Thank you. Irene Azucena Cuellar Albanés. Present. Isela Liliana Miranda Espinosa. Iván Manuel Jerez Pérez. I saw Ivan. Yeah, there he is. Present, present, thank present. you, thank you. René Alfonso Madrid Escalante. I know present. you're driving. It's okay. Be careful. Okay. Wendy Patricia Molina Duarte. Present teacher. There you are. Okay. So next point in the agenda. Do you remember this? No? Do you remember this? Do you remember this? Remember? Come on. Ferrucho, Ferrucho. Who is it? La vida es bella. Come on, guys. You don't know about movies. What's going on with you? Did you like that movie? La vida es bella? Yes. Yes. I never seen it. You have to watch that movie. Okay. So, do you remember this? Uh, what does it take okay four Fernando this is for you what does it take for and then you need a what what does it take for bear ma, ma, la, say, and bear <laughs> no ah. a noun okay or yes you can use a verb a gerund you can use a gerund okay it's optional Okay, second option. Oh, what does it take two? What, what's next? A verb. There you go. Okay, and I forgot the question mark in both. So, of course, you need a compliment. Okay. Give me examples. No matter whatever it takes. Uh, okay. <laughs> no, I, I. It's not an example. <laughs> okay. Now make questions with what does what, it take for or what does it take to. What does it take for hearing a good pronunciation? For getting a good pronunciation. What does it take for getting a good pronunciation? For getting good pronunciation, a good pronunciation, a good accent, maybe. For getting good yep. pronunciation. Okay. Okay. What does it take? What's the answer, Jocelyn? Mm, practicing every single day. Now let's play a game. Let's add quantifiers. Okay, it takes a lot of. <laughs> you got it. A lot of practice. There you go. It takes a lot of practice. Okay, give me another one. What does it take for? What does it take to build a house from, what? from the, how do you say? Uh, from, from zero or from, from the scratch from the scratch the uh, hey that's a good one what does it take to build a house from scratch okay can somebody answer 
It takes a lot of money. <laughs> it takes a lot of money. Okay, what are we doing? Go to your book and you will understand what we're doing. Quantifiers, many, a lot of, a little. Where is it? That's Bunch. on page 15. Page 15, a few, a lot of, some, many, plenty of. No, no. Teacher, um, the word bunch, it could be a, a quantifier. I I heard that word. Yeah. I know what, what it is, but. You know what it is, yeah. It's, uh, it's almost equal to a lot. It takes mm -hmm. a lot, yeah. it takes a bunch of money. It takes a lot, it okay. takes a bunch of money, okay? Okay, more examples, another question, someone. Caroline. Um, what does it take for? Um, doing, no, no, no. Uh, getting a fit body. Mm, again. Mm. What does it take for, I don't know, is the bird correct? Getting a, uh, or get, getting to, getting a fit body? A fake body. Fit. The fitness, a tener un cuerpo fit. Oh, for getting, a, for getting fit. That's it. What does it take yes. for getting fit? What does it take for getting fit? Okay, can somebody answer this question? Some, someone else, someone else. I need to hear yeah. William, Alan. Uh, Juan Francisco, Ada, Sandra, come on, guys. What does it take for getting fit, Doc? Hola, a todos, ¿qué tal? Hola. Bueno, bienvenidos de nuevo. Pues, hombre, bienvenido. Teacher is take a lot of watching our own play. Bueno, yo, Miquel, aquí sí. <laughs> Come on. Come on, guys. Okay, go ahead. It takes a lot of uh, exercise, a lot. Uh, some, some a good alimentation and a lot of exercise. Uh, a lot of discipline. Johnny, cambio. Yes. Bueno, tío. Thanks a lot of discipline. Yeah. And so on. Eh, chicos, por favor, enfoquémonos en lo que estamos. Eh, si son tan amables, porfa. Okay. So it takes a lot of, it takes many hours at the gym. It takes much time. What other quantifiers do you have there? Go to page 15. Look at the quantifiers. Teacher, I have a question. Yes. Uh, if, if I say what it takes is valid or like a son of Aerosmith? Yeah. Hey, good. Mm -hmm. Tell me what it takes to let you go. Yeah. Uh -huh. that yeah, that's valid. Yeah. What it takes. Okay. Thanks. It's informal. Yeah. Because he's 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 omitting the auxiliary, right? What it takes. He's omitting the auxiliary, and they do that a lot in English. Oh, come on! Hey, Andres, give me an example. Uh, for a question, or... <laughs> get it from the song. Get it from the song. Uh, Tell me what it takes. To let you go. 
Man, I'm gonna sleep with that song tonight. Tell me what how the bank's supposed to go wrong. Uh huh. What, what does it take for being responsible? Okay, and there's the thing. You see, that's the oh. tricky thing. You say for, then you need a noun for oh, to no. be responsible, for becoming responsible. Okay, what does it take for you to do something? What does it take for you to hey teacher? If I say what does it take for me to show you? Can I apply it? Sure. To show you. Yeah, why not? How do you answer that question? You're making A the question to yourself. A lot of, oh, so maybe teach you. What does it take for me to teach you? Yeah. Okay. It requires, oh, by the way, you can say it requires, it, it yeah. You need a lot of patience. It takes a lot of patience. Um, what other quantifiers can you use? That's the whole point. What quantifiers can you use? Okay, what does it take for you to make $3,000 a month in El Salvador? All my entire life. <laughs> a year <laughs> a month <laughs> what does it take to make okay give me the answer <laughs> it takes a lot of work 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 <laughs> it takes a lot of work <laughs> okay it takes selling an organ okay I need more quantifiers. It takes much work. It takes much work. Okay, what does it take to make? You see, what does it take to make? You don't need the you, right? You don't need the object. So what does it take to make $3,000 a month? Do you have questions with this? Two versus four? Of course, you do have questions because you're not participating and you're still doubting about this, but you don't want to talk. Okay, quantifiers. There was a simple topic and you should be handling this at this point. So noun count nouns, you can use a little, a little coffee, a little sugar, a lot of sugar, a lot of time, some time, some sugar, right? Much money, much rice, much love, much air, a great deal of sand. Okay, a great deal of sand, plenty of sand, uncountables. Non count nouns, uncountables. Can you give me more examples of uncountables? Okay, let's go. So many. No, no, no. Uh, uncountable nouns. Water. What? Water. Water, yes. Sugar. Sugar, okay. Work. Work. Honey. Sound. Sound. Uh, no. Ivan, I'm not getting it. I'm not getting it, Ivan. Never mind. Did you... No, Stars. Come, on. come on, Ivan. It's just, I didn't hear you. Stars? Can you count the stars? No. No. The feelings? Maybe life? Feelings. Life. Figures. Right? Untangible Sneakers. things. Sneakers? 
Fun. Fun. Plenty of fun. No fun. Okay. Good. Very simple. Now with count nouns. Count nouns, things that you can count. A few lemons, a lot of oranges. Keep going. Computers. Some computers. The smartphones. Many smartphones. Keyboards. <laughs> Plenty of keyboards. Many dogs. Many dogs. Mm -hmm. Or a water. Mm -hmm. What? Again? Bottle of water. Okay, no bottles of water. Plenty Pen. of water bottles. Plenty of water bottles. Pen? Yeah, pens. pens. Yeah, mm -hmm. no pens. There are no pens in the room. Okay, and so on. Okay. What does it take for you to say many words? What does it take for you to say many words? A lot of F word. Come on. Okay, I think you're ready. I think that was good enough. Let's go with. Yep. One more thing. On unit two, we learned about the product life cycle, right? Let's see if some of you remember these questions. What do you, what the customers want from a service or product? What do customers want from a service or product? What do they want? Satisfy a need. Quality. Satisfy a need. Yeah. You got it. Simple as that. Okay. So you will only have five minutes for this activity. I need you to talk about the four P's. What are the four P's? Just describe them a little bit. Compare them with the four C's. Remember the four P's, the four C's. Okay. And try to use, try to remember also the use of enough. You remember how to use enough? Adjectives plus enough or enough plus nouns? Mm -hmm. Okay. Yes. These are the last two topics. So let's talk about it. Four Ps. Okay. And enough. That's the last topic before we jump into the dynamic that I was attempting to do. Okay. Let's do it again. Shall we? Shall we? William, let's go. Okay, perfect. So, so how do you? Um, Come on, let's pick something. The teacher is recording us. Yes, he's here. No matter what we are going to talk because. Okay, we're going to start talking. This is easy, guys. The four Ps. <laughs> what yes. are the four Ps? Uh, product, product price, product, place, promotion. Price, place, promotion. The four C's, I don't, I don't, I don't remember because I didn't assist the class. Okay. 
those two stories. But you're here now, and Jocelyn did. Sandra too. <laughs> Ivan, Ivan, Ivan is always in class, so he knows. He he may remember. Okay. What are the four C's? Can you guys tell Alan about the four C's, please? Yes. Maturity, grow, decline, and I <laughs> No, that was the product life cycle. The four C's were compared with the four P's. It's, it's based, it's focused in, uh, in the client, not the, in the customer. Correct, very good. So that, I don't remember what is the meaning of those. I just read in something like that, that you read side of the customer. Yeah. Customer solutions, customer cost, customer convenience and communication. Customer solutions, customer cost, convenience, and communication. These are the oh, four C's. Okay. In customer solutions, not products, the customers want to buy value or a solution to their problems. It's on the Prezi as well. It's the second Prezi. Uh, in convenience, I'm sorry, in customer cost is not the price. Customers want to know the total cost of acquiring, using, and the posing of a product uh, and so on. That's in your Prezi as well. It's out of the oh. box, out of the book actually. It's very important. Convenience and communication, right? The last one. Convenience, communication, yep. yes. <sighs> yep, 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 yep. Maybe the product must be good enough to attract the attention of the customer. Because if you want to feel that um, characteristic, it's difficult. Yes, difficult. Because we are following these characteristics that you mentioned, but not impossible. Yeah. After you introduce after you introduce the the pro or the new pro, uh, you can and you can analysis uh, the different uh, situation the marketing and what is what kind what kind product needs uh, the customer uh, how many competitors there are in the mark in the um, in the mark market. And um, and you can identify how, how how no you can identify if the customer accept uh, accepting for the for the new product. Yes, uh, I think in that in that point or in that stage and promotion uh, you have to do a marketing strategy because uh, you have to uh, communicate all uh, the pros that the product has to the customers and persuade them to buy your product and uh, okay. perfect, perfect. Oh. Okay, perfect. You are repeat the question, please. Erwin, repeat the question. Okay. What, when, when would you visit the salon, a style salon, what would you prefer? The price or the place? If both are the similar performance, mm -hmm. but the place is so, so far, so far, so far with other price. 
mm. with, with high price. I the the product, no? Sal a salon, a style salon. Yes, depend the product for the the the, uh, the product and the customer, no? Yes, I the similar the similar performance, yes. similar calidad, similar performance. Yes. Yes, in in my case is uh, the prefer the price. Okay, perfect. Yes. Okay, another question. Okay. In the example, we have. The uh, adjective or verb plus enough if, and the uh, noun plus noun. I remember that, yes. that that are the two structures that we we watched. We studied. We started. 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 So if there is an adjective. After yes. adjected, uh, uh, it is the word enough. Yes, you are, enough. You are you're smart enough. Just you're smart just enough. Carl. Smart enough. Or if when if after enough is a noun, for example, you you don't mm -hmm. have enough time. Mm -hmm. For example, you were close enough. Yes, to is to see if I were close enough. <laughs> but I think you earn enough money. I'm sorry, but I think you earn enough money. That was the Fondo Social para la Vienta said to me the last year. <laughs> really? They didn't approve? No, no. Uh, I, I only tried for for seeing what the, the, what what was the amount to, to I was they... just repeat I was just checking yes I was I, I was, was just checking just checking the, the amount that we we get. could uh, could 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 get excellent that we could get yeah I dream being able to pay my house with El Fondo <sighs> yeah, that is difficult uh, I am the 29 years uh, uh, the, 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 the next year I can apply to to the you can Casa Joven yes I can apply with Casa Joven because uh, that is uh, 20 years 29 years how do you say one. how do you say no podré aplicar I I couldn't no perdón no podré I want I won't apply. Hey, wouldn't be el podre. Ah, perdón. Podre, podre, podre. Let's see who get it. Who gets it? Come on. Able? I wouldn't. I wouldn't. Aha, uh -huh, William. I won't. I won't able to. I won't be able to. Close. Close enough. Yes. Yeah. I won't be able to apply. Next year, I won't be able to apply. Won't be able. Don't forget. Could in the past, can in the present, be able in the future. You can okay. also use be able in the past or in yep. the present. I am able to, I was able to, I will be able to. Yeah, I will be able to. Okay, let's go back. Okie dokie, okie dokie. Okay. 
Yeah, okay, I just redo, I just redid, I'm sorry, just redid the groups as you can tell on the chat. Group one goes from Alan to Jocelyn. So let's do it again, okay? Um, Ivan, can you give me a number? Ivan, can you give me a number from one to 27, please? 17. 17 is not here. Another one, Ivan. She has only 16. 16, 16 okay. Sandra Elizabeth Osorto Romero. So group number one is going to break the ice. You're breaking the ice. Okay. Oh, no. No. Oh, and Jocelyn is there again. Okay. Yes. Yeah. I am the lucky one. You know? I'm the lucky one. <laughs> La podemos lucky. Yeah. Give me a minute. So you have this and that. Okay. Ready? Yes. Okay. Let's do it. Let's do it. You can do it. Okay, define demand downturn. Define demand downturn. Your group, not just Jocelyn, but everybody in the group. Okay. Ready? Everybody on the group, define demand downturn. Go to your book, go to the presentation on the chat. You know, you have the Prezi on the chat. Define demand downturn. You have one minute to give okay. the answer. Let's go. Go team, please, please. We can find the answer. Demand downturn. In my own words, it sounds like the decline stage that the, the people doesn't care. The product is like the, the attractive. The product is not attractive enough and you have to decide what you are going to do with. If you sell it to launch or? Yeah. Bankruptcy. Are you going bankruptcy? I mean. Yeah, do you give up? <laughs> Good job, everybody. Woo! Ooh, well done, Alan. Good job, okay. So far you have one point. Excellent, okay. Choose another group, group number one. Select another group. Come on, guys. Alan, select another group because you were the ones who answered the question. Okay. Um, let me see. Uh, number number three. Group number three on the chat, on the WhatsApp. Do you have the groups? Group number three. Group number three is going to answer the next question. Oh, so easy. Group number three, make three sentences using quantity with count nouns, using quantifiers with count nouns. Group number three. Page 15 on your book, page 15. Come on, guys, you can do it. You can do it. I I bought three pupusas today. Oh, a lot of pupusas today. I ate a lot of pupusas today. Good mm -hmm. one. We're missing two. I oh, what am I doing? Oh my God! Tell me. Okay, I ate a lot of pupusas today. That's one sentence. That's cheating, teacher. <laughs> Sorry. Come on, Andres. Someone else on the group. Come on. Okay, I drove a lot of kilometers today. 
use another quantifier, not just a lot of okay. plenty of quantifiers there. Some, some, okay. Some, some, some. I will give you a, so much, a lot of money for two. Again, a lot of use a different quantifier. You're missing 20 seconds. Okay. I want a bigger Google. What? Yeah, I want a bigger Google. I'm not getting it, Irwin. I have many shoes. <laughs> I have many shoes that it was that simple. I have many shoes. Okay, I have much time. I don't have much time. Oh, I don't have much time. You needed to make three sentences, guys. Come on, select another group. Number four. Four, okay. Group number four, are you ready? No. Okay, that means yes. <laughs> Group number four. Oops. Define obsolescence. This is so easy. Define obsolescence. Obsolescence, time is on the board. One minute. In that your concept is words. A, that concept is about the product. Uh, is on um, the on uh, the end of 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 uh, it um, life utility life I don't know how do you say utility life cycle ah the in the end of the of, of the life cycle uh, it, that is that is the time for for how do you say remove from the market it's time for to remove it from the market anybody else in the group who wants to add an extra point. Group number four, add an extra point. You can make two points. Come on, you have 10 seconds. The, the fact teacher that our product is intentionally decided and made so that it will not last for a long time. I didn't get what you said, William. Are you in group number four? Yes, yeah. you were. Okay, paraphrase your answer one more time and I will take the decision. Paraphrase your answer, William. He, for example, uh, mobile phone technology. Mobile phone technology, okay. Or computer feature. Or computers. Quickly that many customers are for example, concerned about obsolescence. When obsolescent. Excellent. Okay, you got the two points, guys. Eh, that's, hey. not, that's not fair. Teacher and the first point. Where's the first point? Yes, because number group, uh, group number four uh, answer the first the first question. Look at your chat. Go to your chat, your your WhatsApp. Yeah. Well, then that, in that case, William gave a free point to group number one. Good job. Uh, yeah, it's other group. Sorry. Okay, group number well, three. Group two. Well, group two has zero point. Oh, because. Come on. No. Okay, group number three. I'm gonna check the the list. Ada, Andres, Irwin, Irene, and Rene. Irene, Susana, and Rene. Irene was answering on group number two. I don't know why. Look at your chat, your Zoom chat. Do you have your groups on your WhatsApp? Les envié la imagen al WhatsApp, una nueva imagen, right? Okay, so group number three, Ada, Andres, Irwin, Irene, and Rene. Next question, so easy. Oh my God, would you prefer to sleep 24 hours, eyes opened, or be muted 24 hours? <laughs> Explain, would you prefer to sleep 24 hours, eyes open, or be muted? 24 hours. 
Okay. Um, I prefer to sleep 24 hours than be mute 24 hours because it's, be it's better for me. In this time, I can I can be I can be well sleeping. Okay. Okay. Anybody else from the group? I disagree. Why? Tell because me. Because you can be mute. Yeah. Mute it. Uh -huh. While you can be sleeping, I think. Yes, you can be muted while you're sleeping. Hey, and look at the first part. Mm -hmm. Irene, sleeping 24 hours with your eyes open. Uh, okay. Oh <laughs> I did. Yes, yes. <laughs> I, I didn't. I didn't read that. Okay, okay, good job. Thank you, Andres. Save the day. Okay, we're still missing some minutes. Let's go with group number one again. Ready, group one? Teacher, sorry, no. but I think you're wrong. Why am I because wrong? Because you never asked the number two. I never asked number two. Yeah. Okay, Alexander, yes. Elvin, Juan Francisco, Wendy, and Suleima. Okay, group number but two. You, but you write zero points, points for group number two. Okay, I'll give you the point. Don't cry for <laughs> me, Argentina. <laughs> We continue with <laughs> what was that? We continue with the drama tonight. Okay. Define discontinue. Group two. Define discontinue. Mm, I think that is uh, like uh, the declining stage of the product life cycle when your uh, your sales decrease a lot and you have to think about discontinue your product or if you can uh, make a, a relaunch of your of your product or load your prices to continue with the product in the market that was amazing thank you Suleyma Anybody two else points. in the group wants to add another? Yeah, I'm thinking about giving you two points. Okay. Yeah, you got the two points. Yeah. I, will, yeah, I will do it. Yeah, I will do it. <laughs> the golden buzzer. Teacher, the golden buzzer. Do you know what's the golden buzzer, right? America's got talent. Got talent, yeah. <laughs> okay, who's next? Shall we go back to group number one? Yes. Okay, and that was Alan, mm -hmm. Ivan, Roberto, Sandra, and Jocelyn. Okay, let's go with group number one again. Tienen que estar buzos cuando hagamos esta dinámica si les envío algo al chat, señores. Come on. Okay, next, group number one. Define market saturation. Someone in group number one. Okay, anybody who wants to answer this question, I'll give you three points if you give me the best definition. Market if saturation. You me the trip, if you give me the three okay. points, I answer the no, question. No. Go ahead. No. I, I, you, you got the time. <laughs> time time's running. You the volume, volume it's, it's, when you, it's when you oversaturate the market or when product. you have a lot of competitors. The in the many market. competitors. <laughs> No, when you looks babel when the demand increase. <laughs> okay, Ivan, give me the answer. When a product uh, is a uh, or service um, is uh, maximized in the marketplace, it's maximized. No. It's maximized. Yes, it's a point of saturation. A company can only achieve uh, growth through the new no. product improvements. When in the market there is too many competitors. Yes. It's when the demand 
increased a lot. No. 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 Guys, saturation. There's enough. There's no, no, no. Just be careful. Be careful. You, you don't. No, no, no. Oh. <laughs> I can get no satu. Saturation is not the same as satisfaction, but yes, is when there are two two perspectives, and you're taking the one from your, from the competitors. When uh, the market is saturated of competitors. And we didn't see that. We talked about the product being saturated. You already satisfied the need of your consumers with your product. Now, at that point, can you sell more? Can you increase the price? No. No, no right? You have reached the ceiling on the price. Awesome. But yes, as well. You have a lot of competitors and the market is saturated of that product line. Too many calzones chinos, that's enough. Good job. Hey, come on. ¿Le gustó la dinámica o no? Lo veo así como medio... Yes, <laughs> I think it's good enough. <laughs> oh, okay, thank you. That was good enough. Okay. Okay, hey, bien. Tonight, uh, tengo un pequeño dilema. Uh, porque nuestro compañero que te toca ahora la sesión está manejando. Um, so I'm going to ask Sandra Elizabeth to stay tonight, will you? For 10 minutes with me. Yes, Sandra, 10 minutes. La perdimos, se desconectó, se congeló. Hi, Sandra, hola. Sí. She's gone. Oh, Okay, Werner is not here. William Alexander, can you stay 10 minutes? It's going to be jumping. Yes, teacher. Okay. Qué mala onda son. Okay. We're not leaving yet. Wait a minute. I have to figure this out. Okay. Jocelyn Imelda, can you stay 10 minutes? I cannot. You cannot. Okay. I'm... Yes, sorry. Don't worry. Suleyma Yvonne. Not oh. for today, teacher. Not for today. Ada Susena, can you stay 10 minutes? Yes, teacher. It's okay. Thank you very much, Doc. Okay, let me do the attendance. And I already have Ada Susena Cáceres Mendoza. Present, teacher. Alexander de Jesus Sanchez Soto. Present. Good night. Good night. Andres Giovanni Valdivieso Portillo. Present. Good night. Good night. Elvin Arcide Seguizabal Martinez. Present. Good night. Good night. Irwin Lagos Andrade. Good teacher. Good night. Good night. Fernando Ernesto Cosme Morales. Present. Good night. Yeah. Good night. Heidi Eugenia Salguero de Rivas. Johnny Vladimir Portillo Chavez. Present teacher. José Antonio Cubías Hernández. Josué Alberto Salas Benítez. Juan Francisco Enríquez González. Present teacher, good night. Good night. Yuri Vladimir Cruz Ventura. Luis Ernesto Romero Argueta. Present teacher, good night. Good night. Miguel Ángel Paz Landa Verde, Roberto Luis Umaño Orellana, Sandra Elizabeth Osorto Romero, y Werner Mauricio Reyes Ángel, William Alexander Ramírez Flores. Present. Good. Jocelyn Imelda Rivas Abarca. Present. Good night, Suleima Yvonne Moreno de Hernández. Present. Good night, Alan Christopher Abrego Brizuela. Present, see you. See you. Carolina Ivette Romero Avelino. Present, good night. Good night, Irene Azucena Cuellar Alpanet. Present, good night. Good night, Isela Liliana Miranda Espinosa, Iván Manuel Jerez Pérez. Present, teacher, good night. Good night, Iván René Alfonso Madrid Escalante. Present. Good night, teacher. Good night, Wendy Patricia Molina Duarte. Present, teacher. Good night. Good night. Okay, okay. the dog. English. Okay, let's play some. 
Okie dokie doc. Vamos a hacer algo. Vamos a divertir un ratito. Gracias por quedarse conmigo diez minutitos. So, let's go back to the basics. Tenía, solo que tengo una duda con lo que estaba explicando hoy. ¿Sí? Por ejemplo, yo tenía, si would rather play guitar o tengo que usar the guitar than ah. the violin. Uh -huh. okay. En el caso, pues, Ahí lo hizo bien. She would rather play, que es el punto, ¿no? Después de rather, no voy a poner nada más que el verbo en su forma base, sin el tú. Muy bien. Uh -huh. She would rather play the guitar or the violin. O sea que si pongo da, está equivocado. No, también then, pero hay que entender que then es como en lugar de. She would rather play the guitar than the violin. En lugar del violín. Y también puedo hacerlo en este caso. She eh, prefer, she would prefer play guitar. To play the guitar or play in the guitar. Ok. Ese o sea, lo puedo usar en ambos. Sí, solo que al usar prefer, I will prefer, she will prefer, voy a ocupar to y el verbo o el verbo en ng. She will prefer to play the guitar. She will prefer playing the guitar. Cualquiera de los dos. Ok. Uh -huh. Sí, es que te la iba a preguntar cuando estábamos hablando, pero mejor me quedé calladita. Ah, no, no, no se quede callada. Le aseguro que no, muchos, o sea, le aseguro que muchos se quedaron callados y con esa misma duda. Estoy segurísimo. Es la, misma, la misma pregunta se puede utilizar a la vez con las dos formas gramatical, sí. ¿no? Uh -huh. Correcto, correcto. Y ese era el punto del ejercicio, pero todos se quedaron callados. Y estoy segurísimo de que les hago un examen de eso y... Sí, sí, porque está pasando bastante con la plataforma, creo. No sé si será porque a veces usamos la, la primera letra en mayúscula o minúscula, porque, por ejemplo, hay un ejercicio donde pide las 4P. Algunos, vi que les estaba saliendo ahí que pueden usar Product, price, place y promotion. Yo uh -huh. lo puse al inicio con P mayúscula y no me lo acepta. Puse todas las P mayúscula y tampoco lo acepta. Entonces, yo a veces no. O sea, sí, suele pasar a veces con la plataforma. Pero en ese caso, escríbame y yo le contesto. Ok, aunque me entrale un poquito, pero yo contesto. En ese caso. El, el uso del no, ¿verdad? Creo que ese fue el tema de noche. Anoche cubrimos bastante ese tema porque su querido teacher hizo al revés. Hablamos de marketing antier y ayer de enough. Y era al revés la cosa, pero igual lo terminamos cubriendo. Y ayer al final hablamos, de hecho hoy teníamos que haber cubierto esa parte también. Haber continuado con el tema final de, de marketing. Les envié un montón de, un artículo sobre eso. Sí, está de preferencia, creo que era algo así, una en donde, bueno, yo medio lo revisé, como le digo, traté de ingresar a ver el, el video, pero no sé si está, como le, el, el sistema está dando problemas, vea, porque uh -huh. no lo pude revisar, vi que estaba como trabado en las grabaciones. Qué raro. Entonces, entonces lo voy a revisar mejor quizá en la computadora, porque el teléfono a veces da su problema. Uh -huh. Sí, ¿verdad? claro. Ok, Doc, let's see something really quick. Tenemos cuatro minutos, vamos a ver. Ok, Doc, mm -hmm. what are they doing? Drink, beber, ¿no? Ok, very good. Drink. Drink. Walk, en la primera. Ok, walk. 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 Y packet, que está empaquetando. Pack. 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 Son verbos, walk, ¿eh? Pack. Verbos, 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 ajá. Eat, la chica del medio. Y lleva una araña, creí que se estaba comiendo. Yeah, ¿no? it is. Parece, sí. Sí, yes. Ok. Get dressed, está cambiándose la chumpa ahí, ¿no? Get dressed. Get dressed. Get ok. Dressed. Shoot. Shut. 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 Shut the walk. door. Shut What's the walk? Like, es el tercer, el cuarto. Ok, very good. Get dressed. El chico que se está vistiendo igual a cuatro. Vestirse. Shut okay. the door. Shut the door. El dos. Cerrar la puerta. 
Okay. Cerramos la puerta, se puso drink the water, igual la figura 2. Okay, Come, tomar agua, ¿no? Yes. The bag. Pack bag, en la quinta. Okay, pack, pack a bag. Pack, 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 pack. Spider. Eat a spider. Eat a spider. Comer. Eh, comer eh, arañas. Comer una araña, okay, comer una araña. Yes. Okay. Again, drink. Yes. Okay, so she. She drinks water. Very good. She, she drinks water. She drinks water. Shoot. Shut. Shut. Neg negative. She doesn't shut the door. She doesn't shut the door. Yes. Walk. 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 She doesn't walk. She doesn't walk. Uh -huh. She doesn't walk. Very good. Eat. Eat. She doesn't eat. It's she spider. doesn't eat spiders. Very good. Fuck. <laughs> she he packs her bus. Very good. She packs, she packs her bag. Her bag. He get dressed. Get dressed. She get dressed. Very good. She gets she gets dressed. Dressed. Mm -hmm. Does she shut the door? Does she shut the door? No. No. Does she shut the door? No. No. Does, what does she uh -huh. pack? What does she pack? A bag. What does she pack? Yes. Mm -hmm. No, no, no. Mm -hmm. A bag. A bag. Does she get dressed? Yes. Yes. No. no. Yes. No, she drink. Logical oh. answers. What, what does what? the drink? Water. Water. Very good. That's it. Uh huh. That was simple present. So easy. Okay. So easy. Ya, ya lo dominamos. En terceras personas. Siempre modificamos el verbo cuando la oración está en positivo. Okay. Muy bien. En negativo necesita doesn't para terceras personas. He should y don't para las demás personas. Don't forget it. Super bien, Doc. Muchísimas gracias por quedarse conmigo unos minutos. Y Doc, escríbame, Doc. Grábeme un audio. Voy a escuchar esto de, 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 no, porque sí me interesa. No, no, hoy que estaban hablando no entendía mucho. Perfecto. Mándeme un audio, con, mándeme un audio, mándeme un audio con 10 oraciones usando enough. Okay, okay teacher. Perfecto. <ríe> ok, Doc. Bye, Doc. Good night. Good night. Gracias.